Hey guys, welcome back to another vlog. Whenever I start these vlogs, I honestly don't even know like what I have planned for them. I do want to make it kind of like a fall themed vlog because I do want to decorate the house. Even though I don't feel the most energetic right now, I feel so tired lately, but I wanna take this weekend to do that. It's Friday today. I went to Trader Joe's last night. All of the pumpkin stuff is out, all of the fall stuff. I would have had a bigger Trader Joe's haul, but I had gold stuff, so I had to put that away but i did keep a bag of things that are not cold that i wanted to show you guys i also picked up some flowers after that i will start getting organized to decorate even though i do want to vacuum and tidy up a little bit so yeah i'm gonna go ahead and start on that i hope that you guys are doing great today thank you so so much for being here with me today let's do a trader joe's haul so i got basic things like spinach fruits i got hummus those types of things but next time i go if i come back at an early time i will definitely do like a complete haul but i just wanted to go ahead and show you like the seasonal things that are in i'm super excited lots of pumpkin stuff so this is for my fall girlies so let's go ahead and let's get into the haul. All right, so I found these, which I thought were so cute. Hot cocoa melts. This has cinnamon flavored white chocolate with milk chocolate drops and marshmallows. Look how cute. It's little pumpkins. So I know the girls are gonna really, really like this. So I got that. These are not pumpkin, but this is literally my guilty pleasure. These are so good. These are milk chocolate covered mini pretzels. Someone needs to just hide them from me because they're just so freaking good. And I'm not even a pretzel girl like that. Next to those, I saw these, which are the pumpkin spice teeny tiny pretzels. And these have yogurt flavored coating and crushed pumpkin spice pumpkin seeds. I'm excited to try this out. They look really, really good. Even the dogs got pumpkin dog treats. These are pumpkin maple bacon flavored stuffies so these are super duper cute i hope they like them for the girls i got halloween jojo cookies and these are like oreos and they have little cute pumpkin faces so they're gonna like these a lot then i picked up this pumpkin pie spice so i'm gonna be adding this to my coffee starting fall time i usually add cinnamon but i'm gonna go ahead and add a little bit of this on top of my whipped cream to give it a little bit of like a fall touch and then last but not least you guys i got the body care i got the pumpkin body butter i fell in love with the coconut body butter so so much so i had to pick this one up and see how this smells and then i also got the pumpkin body scrub so this is going to be great for fall time so those are all of the fall pumpkin themed things that i picked up this trip at trader joe's along with the gorgeous gorgeous flowers i am so in love with them at target i picked up another mop head the pumpkin and the fall things in this house it's a thing i got cinnamon pumpkin spice trash bags okay i usually get my trash bag scented because it just makes it smell so good whenever you open up the trash and my husband knows me so well he's like all right here's the trash bags we're getting and i'm like what cinnamon pumpkin spice trash bags they smell really really good so that's gonna help to make the house smell like fall and then for the girls for this weekend, I picked up like these little Halloween bubbles and stuff. We're not really doing anything this weekend. We just wanna kinda like stay home and relax. And they got these little coloring books for activities. They got these little houses that they're gonna go ahead and paint. I got another coffee mug, you guys. Like I know it's not necessary, but she had to come with me. Isn't she so cute? And she was $3, adorable, so. I need to chill with the coffee mugs. 
It's about to be 10 o'clock. So I'm gonna go ahead and make me some breakfast and some coffee because I have not drank coffee today and I need it. To be completely 100% honest, I'm not even in like the mood to decorate today, but like I want it done. I wish I could just kind of like wave my finger and boom, have everything like decorated already because I am tired today. Like I look tired, I feel tired, but yeah, I'm gonna go ahead and make breakfast. The only one that's home right now is Penelope. The other girls are at school. She's watching Mickey Mouse and and she already had breakfast so I'm gonna go ahead and make breakfast for myself and then get started with kind of organizing what I want to bring out I'm gonna go to the garage but the garage is a hot mess because everything that we have like bulk to get rid of is in the garage the old sofas are in the garage I know that my husband organized the bin so I know where the fall decor is at I just don't know if I could get to it but I'm gonna try so yeah I'm gonna do that in a bit so I'm gonna make some breakfast and then I will come right back. So this little corner is kind of already a little decorated. I have a little pumpkin going on there. I found another one of these. So I have one upstairs in my beauty room and I wanted to put this one here with this little mug that I'm gonna use today. This one is from, I don't even know where I got this. I think when I lived in Tampa, I don't remember. But I'm gonna go ahead and show you guys the coffees that I picked up. I have to refill my coffees. I'm not a fan of the vanilla flavor that I got, so I'm gonna empty some of these out and save them and put the ones that I really, really like. But I did get the pumpkin spice cake pods, so I want to try these. I'm not gonna try it today because I'm just in the mood for my regular coffee, which usually I just do these small ones because I just like, like a small shot of this one, which is... Altisio, this one's really small. I ate breakfast I'm back I'm about to start getting everything but I remembered that I got these and I wanted to show it to you guys especially my mommies out there I like to keep you guys in mind because I just relate to you guys a lot so Target has the cutest little things to use for like Halloween movie nights we want to start watching a lot of Halloween movies starting this month with the girls so Hocus Pocus, Halloween Town, Haunted Mansion, you know, all of those like classic Halloween movies that we can have like family night. I bought Halloween cookies. I like to do popcorn. I like to do candy corn and snacks. So they have these at Target. This one is so cute for popcorn. I'm going to be using these for popcorn. And then these to put either cookies or snacks or anything like that. So I just wanted to show you guys these in case you're interested. They are, I believe it was $3 each and they're so, so adorable. So yeah, I'm super excited for the season. As you can tell, it's my favorite time of the year from now all the way until winter, my birthday, New Year's, all of that. So all of the second half of the year is my favorite. And it's kind of like when I thrive the most. I feel like spring and summer to me are just like, okay, like they're nice, but fall and winter are just special. So now I'm gonna go ahead and go to the garage and see if I could find my fault. And this is what I mean by the garage is a complete disaster because there's still boxes from when we moved. Things are just all over the place, but those are the bins right there. So if I'm not mistaken, that one right there is a fall one. This one obviously is a fall one. I'm just not sure. I think this one's also fall. I don't think I'm gonna put this up yet, but I have my little Mickey Mouse halloween decorations from costco but i think i'm gonna wait for this a little bit closer to october this one's also fall oh it smells like candles i have a candle in there these are my little hocus pocus pops and i have a pumpkin candle from bath and body works that i did not even know was in here yeah these are more like halloween stuff which i'm not sure i want to decorate for halloween yet my mom got me this last year hocus pocus two candle oh my god i forget see you forget all of the things that you have sometimes like that's why i didn't want to go too crazy buying too much stuff but this one i'm gonna wait well i'm gonna wait for this one i just want to put like fall colors right now 
Oh my god, this weekend is going to be full of cleaning up and organizing. All right, this is what I'm looking for. Fall colors. All right, so here's everything that I took out from this bin right here. I took out this cute one. I think I'm gonna put this in the living room by the TV. I forgot I even had this one. I used to put this as a backdrop for my videos. I have little pumpkins, candle holders, more pumpkins. This I'm not going to use this year. It, this is so old. I think this is like from 2015. Hmm. Or maybe I can put it in the bathroom with this pumpkin. I think I'm gonna do the bathroom with green one. So yeah, maybe I will try and revive that because it's all squished but i have this pumpkin i have this beautiful wooden pumpkin this little stack of books that i'm gonna change out because i do have one in a little table in the hallway and then these two so now i'm just gonna i took out all of the green things and i'm gonna put them all in I'm going to take upstairs to the girls bathroom it's a little gnome and I'm gonna put these little pumpkins next to it so that's gonna go in their bathroom so in the dining table I put that arrangement that I got from Target I have to wash the placemats which I'm gonna put in a bit and then here I have my flowers that I got from Trader Joe's with this little pumpkin cookie jar that I filled with cookies <coughs> My Bath and Body Works candle with the candle holder and a little pumpkin. I changed this and I put this little wooden plate with my mum scent from Mrs. Myers. Also the surface cleaner. I have my pumpkin little pot. I love it. I always take it out this time of the year. Then over here is my coffee things. But I put these in here, the ones that I got from Target, which I showed in my haul. And then over here in the living room, Penelope's playing, so there's toys. But I put these pillows here, which I really, really like. And then I put these on this corner.
guys so it has been a few days since i picked up the camera to vlog i'm not sure how long this vlog is because i did do fall decorating but i just wanted to pick up the camera because i've been spending the morning in my beauty room today doing a bunch of like organizing decluttering and not on the perfume side of my room but on the beauty side i have way too much makeup and i need to like kind of pause on the buying like i've seen a few new releases and i've skipped out on them because i need to kind of like narrow down my collection and relax for a bit sometimes i feel like really overwhelmed because all of those drawers are makeup and sometimes when i want to pick out my makeup it's like i don't know what i like what do i use so since i do know that i want to do fall makeup and things like that coming up i figured i could clean out one of my little acrylic organizers completely and have that be like my perfume tray but as like a makeup tray that way i can focus on those makeup products for the month and give them use and kind of rotate my collection just like how i do with my perfumes so that's what i've been doing all morning i have like a few products here that i'm going to be using for fall time i did a lot of organizing so here i have you see this this is just ridiculous this is all my foundations my concealers here i have like lip balms nail glue eyebrow products loose eyeshadows and then here i have all like spf primer skin tints so i got it all organized like face prep these are my favorite face prep products that i always show in my makeup videos i emptied this one out completely i did clean it with a clorox wipe so it has a little bit of still kind of wet there and here i'm going to add the products that i want to use like the next times that i get ready that way i don't have to be wondering like what am i gonna wear what am i gonna do i already want to have eyeshadow palettes uh, lip products blushes so i gotta figure out how i'm gonna do it so that's what i'm doing right now so i'm cleaning up the beauty room but i did want to show these before i put them away because i'm just super duper grateful and i wanted to just give it a little spot on my channel these are things that were sent to me and these are the things that I absolutely love as a content creator is when brands just send you products and they don't expect nothing in return because they're so confident in their products that they know that nine times out of ten you're going to talk about them. So lately I've been getting extra picky with like who I accept things from because I don't want to feel obligated to do anything. Like I want to be able to give my honest opinion. I want to be able to say this is not for me. I didn't like it. I don't want to feel like I have to please anyone because at the end of the day i'm also a consumer i'm just sharing my experiences with an audience so when brands send things like this i just really appreciate it they send it over they're not expecting anything in return and nine times out of ten those are the products that i end up really enjoying and sharing with you guys for example alter ego they sent over some eyeshadow palettes i strongly recommend this company if you're looking for affordable makeup this is the way to go so yeah alter ego they sent me a package once before and i absolutely love the quality of their eyeshadows so i got the sakura palette which i already featured in a get ready with me and i got the harmony palette which is beautiful as well i'm gonna show them to you guys so here are the eyeshadow palettes this one reminds me of a natasha denona palette i believe so i did do a look using these shades right here and they were so so beautiful it was like a cool brown their shadows just have really really nice performance and the way that they swatch okay so there you go I was my camera was just acting so crazy and they're so sweet over at alter ego working with them it's just so amazing it doesn't feel forced and i really really appreciate that so thank you so much to alter ego for sending these over i also got a package from kaja thank you so much to kaja these are the new juicy glass lip oils there is already one missing because i gave one to my daughter but these are the new lip oils they are fruit infused formula they hydrate plump and add shine non-sticky and they help plump the look of lips so there is a rose hip spritz raspberry refresher grape glutini which is the one i gave my daughter and plum paloma these look super pretty i'm going to add these to my little drawer where i put my lip products i usually choose something from here when i'm getting ready to prep my lips so i'm going to be using those soon i also got a package from a new skincare brand available at sephora it's called matter of fact 
and they sent over their minimalist hydrating moisturizer which i'm very very excited to try out you guys know i love skincare especially now that i am looking for hydrating products for when the weather starts getting a little bit colder so i do love the packaging of this it is a pump type of packaging and i love these because you don't have to be dipping your fingers in them they don't get contaminated or anything so i'm going to add this to my drawer of skincare it will be one of the moisturizers i will be using soon and they also sent over this brightening and firming serum so this has 20 percent of the sorbic acid with ferulic acid and maritime pine so hopefully this one does not irritate me and here is the beautiful packaging it's like a tiffany blue color i love this packaging so thank you so much to matter of fact i'm going to be trying these out very soon and if i end up really really enjoying these products you will definitely be hearing about them in favorites videos and then last but not least i got a package from pacifica beauty I am so excited for this package and I'm so grateful. This was so generous of Pacifica Beauty. So thank you so, so much. I cannot wait to try out all these products. I got reusable eye mask for the under eye area, which I am so excited about because I ran out of my under eye mask and you guys know I love doing that in the mornings. We have some new perfumes that I'm going to be talking about on upcoming videos. This is Silver Moon. I'm going to add this to my little basket of new fragrances so that I can do a haul for you guys as well as island vanilla and a little spoiler alert i loved both of them in the air when i sprayed them so i just need to give them wears but they smell really really good for like every day so i just cannot wait to get into all of these things thank you so much to pacifica beauty and that is it for the products that i got sent to me recently so i'm going to organize those products and put them away and i did want to show you one more thing which is a bath and body works order that i got i usually do bath and body works hauls but i don't think i need to do a haul for this because it's wallflowers but they recently had a wallflower sale and they were like two dollars and fifty cents or something like that the two packs were five bucks so i took advantage and i ordered some so here is my box of goodies i did get this super adorable wallflower plug for free because i did have some points so i did redeem the points for this one i'm gonna put this in the kitchen i am in love with that and then i just got two of these simple black ones because i do have a basket downstairs filled with plugs but i always like to get these extra ones and i have to go through my old ones to see which ones work and don't work because you can go and exchange them without a receipt if they stop working they'll exchange them for you for whichever one you choose from the same price range so if you didn't know that that is a great benefit of shopping for the wall plugs at bath and body works so i did pick up mahogany vanilla i got two of sweater weather which is my all-time favorite scent for fall time so I picked up two of these because they did not have a two pack of this one. So this is amazing. This smells a little unisex. It smells crisp. It smells like fall time. It just makes your house smell so refreshing in a fall way. So it's not super warm or gourmand. It's just like a very crisp feeling type of scent. And then I picked up the mahogany vanilla. I have not smelled this yet, but I'm excited about that one. Also picked up pumpkin bonfire, which I think I've had in the past, but I don't really remember if I enjoyed this one or not. And let me show you the candles I got. So the first candle I got, praline delight. This smells so good. I smelled it in the store one day when I went to go do an order Order pickup and I just ended up picking it up so this has notes of roasted pecans brown sugar and creamy caramel it smells super duper gourmand perfect for like the kitchen area mm. it smells so good the caramel it literally smells like you have like a dessert in the oven so i cannot wait to burn this one and i love the design of it it's super duper cute and then this other one is also very gourmand and i have gotten this one before i love this one this is pumpkin cupcake and the packaging, oh, I love it. So this one has notes of Madagascar vanilla, pumpkin spice, freshly baked cupcake. It literally smells like a pumpkin cupcake. 
so yummy and sweet so if you're not a fan of like the super spicy pumpkin this one will give your house like a fall vibe but then that vanilla makes it very sweet and creamy so it's not too spicy and then for the wallflowers here's all of the two packs that i got so i got sweet cinnamon pumpkin beautiful for fall time this has warm cinnamon fresh ground clove and vanilla cream i got strawberry snowflakes this is leading more towards the winter fragrances but i got this for the girls room because I love these types of scents for their bathroom and for their room. This one has juicy strawberry, whipped cream, and iced bergamot. Here we have flannel, one of my favorites. I've always told you guys about the little story behind flannel. It's the first scent that I put in my husband's apartment when he lived on his own and it just brings back so many cute memories. So this has fresh bergamot, heirloom, mahogany, and soft musk leaves, which is like a staple for fall time. This is crisp red apple, golden nectar, warm clove spice. I got crisp morning air and this one is fresh and relaxing. It has fresh pine, juniper, and juicy pear. So for those of you, again, who do not like spicy pumpkin or clove or spice type of scents, these are nice ones. It's like fresh fall scent. For my bedroom, I got lavender and vanilla. This just really relaxes me at bedtime. So I love this. I love the candle of it and I love the pillow mist of it as well. This has lavender blossoms, creamy vanilla, white woods, and sugared musk. And the last one I got is caramel pumpkin swirl this is warm and comforting it has luscious caramel ground cinnamon rich brown sugar and creamy vanilla so i am pretty stocked up when it comes to wallflowers for now next time they throw another sale i'll go ahead and pick up some more because i really missed my wallflowers i was picking up like the ones from target like the glade ones and the airwick ones and those are fine they smell good but the bath and body works ones i mean i I've just loved having these in my home ever since I moved out on my own. It's just like, I love it so much. So yeah, that is it for this vlog. I don't wanna make it too long. I know that I have decorating and I have all of this stuff that I showed you guys. So I'm going to end it here. And I hope that you guys enjoyed it. I hope that you had some fun like girl time with me. And that's gonna be it for me today. Thank you so much for watching. Give this video a big thumbs up if you enjoyed it. Comment down below about anything. I love to chat with you guys. And with that said, subscribe if you haven't subscribed. And I will see you guys in the next one. Thank you.